Hello everyone, welcome back to the Prisma Ilya Tzvai commentaries. We're on episode 9, Lone Battle, which is strange because uh, as far as I'm aware, they're teaming up. Uh, you know, Ilya, Chloe, and Mew, but maybe not. Maybe that's not the case, in which case this will be interesting. Uh, let's see how this goes, everyone, in 3, 2, 1, play. God, Bazit is still the best. One thing I do really appreciate, and it's funny because it's happening now, but in general, this show really doesn't deal with flashbacks to the previous episode. There's no previously on, which I, when anime do previously ons that last like five minutes, One Piece is bad for that. It, not as much anymore, but there was a time when I just couldn't even like, it's funny because it is recapping now, but it's action scenes, so it's okay. Um, but there was a time where I'm like, I can't watch One Piece. Having five minutes of recap and then a, you know, two and a half minute opening, your episodes are really only like 15 minutes long. Like, less. God, you're so cool, August. Or August. Whatever. I want to get him as a, as a demi-servant. Or a pseudo-servant. I get those mixed up. I apologize. What a baller move. I wonder if you're tied to your magical element, if you have an innate defensive boost against it. Like, if you're... If you're a Geomancer type, you know... Not Geomancer, Gemmancer. Like, if, if you're all about the, the jewels, do you have a natural defensive affinity against them? Or it, or was that just a, I don't care, I will blow you up with me move? To protect the Goyles. Yeah. Even in injury, coffee in the morning, real nice. Even if sitting hurts. But oh well, it's my job. My job, my jobs are the same thing. It's sitting and talking. Whether that's being a teacher or being a YouTube commentator. And either way, like when one of those is gone, or when both, like if I lose my voice, that's it. I can't make money. The sitting I could potentially get around, I could come up with a setup for it. You know, I could I could stand and do these videos if I really wanted to. I'd look like a crazy person, but I could. It's possible. Especially because I was just given, by the time this goes up, it'll be up anyways, but I was given a code for um, Atelier Ryza 2, so uh, an embargoed code, so I'm going to need to get that up, get that recorded. So I got to get used to sitting down anyways. Did she end up buying it? Cafe Petite Boom. That's Cafe Little Apple. Are you talking pudding? Oh, right, the Yokon, right. Never had Yokon. Yeah, they use the magic word for thaumaturgical, which would, in most other, you know, fate media, they just call it magecraft because it's easier to write and easier to say instead of thaumaturgical. Hmm. Well, I guess she'd be with the church, too. But yeah, it's a lot of sugar in your tea. People have told me don't expect too much from Karen. She's here. Just don't expect too much. 
Unless you're... I was gonna say, unless you're a liar, but no, never mind. She's at that rebellious age. Wow. Just narking on him. See, I'd feel more, like, sad for the house if it wasn't for the fact that Luvia could absolutely just buy a new one. She's so rich. Ooh, you put down the, the container. Interesting. Whoa! That was a cool transformation! She just, like... Twisted up like Vincent Valentine. Like full on Advent children. Why is Kuro so cool? Oh my god. Just using the tree like a berserker sword. Yeah, whoa, okay, there's that reflection in the eyes. Very interesting. Wait, what? Was that, so, is that the class card? Like, Guardian for the, because we never saw the class card for, so you're the one who sealed the Archer card, okay. Cool, I like that design for Archer. They're so cool, she just threw it! Okay, so she was the original one sent on the mission. Oh, and there's like Lancer looks like his um proto version almost. Those are cool redesigns. I like it. I will say, her design doesn't a hundred percent look like the Bazit I know. It is the art style, absolutely. Oh man, crusty video again. I'm gonna have to reset my computer. I hate this. I don't know why it's doing this. I have to reset my computer every morning to stop the crust. Thankfully from the uh, YouTube end, it'll be fine.
That's new. Did she just power up her fist with rune magic? I guess so, probably. Makes sense. She has that. Being Irish and whatever. I guess that also makes sense why her cards are in uh, the Prisma Codes event. Hers are increase your quick, because it's green. Rad, even her feet. Oh yeah, I was gonna. I was like, why? Now I know why. Fragrack. Fragrack is so cool. It's like, oh, are you are you gonna use your super move? I interrupt it during super flash. Oh. Rad. I like the star shields. Those are cool. I was going to say, I was going to say, could you do one in her? And the answer is absolutely. Frick, that's cool. Just a precision strike. All things considered, you survived blowing yourself up pretty well. Look at this Shin Megami Tensai dungeon. The Goyles, oh no! It is nice to have Luvia have the, like, we get to see so much more of her in this that really shows that, while she is the, the, you know, the rich Ojo-sama, she still absolutely cares about them. You know, she's still a person who, sh who is compassionate. I'm s did she just lift up the ground? Of course. Surprisingly weak corset. I do wonder if Chloe can do card stuff or if she's like a, if she's the, the, you know, the, the, the sixth ranger, as it were, who follows her own rules. Like, does she not? Because she always is. What the heck? Oh, right. Oh, right. Oh, and someone pointed out they talk about the curse of mutual, um, of mutual pain or whatever in, uh, Hollow Ataraxia. 
the primeval curse of mutual pain. Like, holy crap, way to bring it back round. Well, we know one of those gets given to Miyu. I was going to say, speaking of, where is Miyu? Right, she's on her Yokon journey. As it feels nothing for beating up actual children. Dang. Dang. The Yokon! Rad! Look at that push block. Hmm. Maybe should have, uh, maybe you should have reinforced the, uh, better ground passage a bit more if it's shaking that much. Yeah. Oh, that's rad. Oh, that's real cool. Oh, that's great. She's CG. That fits Miu. Absolutely. It's interesting because, like, you have all the cards and you kind of know what they're going to be. It's just a case of who's going to get it and in what circumstance. That's rad. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. Um, I've been looking into the Prisma Ilya 3DS game. Um, in the collector's edition, which comes with a uh, a Figma, not a, not a Figma, um, a petite Nendoroid, which I already have the one of um of uh, Avenger for. Um, the 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 collector's edition bonus is the Rider uh, class card, and so I was always like, hmm. I wonder what that means, and I guess it's, hey, this form, right? I mean, the only thing is, one, the 3DS is region locked, so I wouldn't be able to play it. And two, it's in Japanese, so I wouldn't be able to play a Prisma Ilia RPG. I'd be interested in, you know, trying my best and seeing what it's like, but I might just wait until the 3DS emulator can run it better, because I can't record it anyways. Like, I don't have a 3DS recorder, those are super gone. It's also kind of cool to see an extended fight scene on the Pegasus, because you don't really have that with Ryder almost ever. She charges with it, and it disappears usually.
Okay, the the animation there really looks oh frick rad, but the animation really looks like an SMT demon. It's 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 the frame rate of its wings. She's not wrong. They are, just in a secret passage where they're safe. But, I mean, Miyu doesn't know about that. Oh, does she have mystic eyes in this? Yep! See, this is where it's, I feel like you need to have at least seen Stay Night. Because they're not explaining that, you know... The, that heroic spirit was Medusa, so that's why. In general, don't, much like Jojo, don't skip parts for fate. Follow the order. I say as I'm really not, because I'm playing the Prisma Codes event, which comes after Tuzvaiher, so... Jewel class is higher than gold? That's new. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, you're not supposed to do that. Oh, no. So her body is moving unconsciously, even, to do Fragrack. Oh, Fragrack is cut between episodes. No! No! Fragrack's so cool! I was wondering, because she didn't have Fragrack near her, but I guess it doesn't even have to be near her. It just, it, 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 it's answerer. It answers the question, right? It is a free... It's a free... Oh, God. Frick. I think in fighting game terms, and it's like, it's literally, do you have meter? You will answer someone super with your own first. It will cancel. And yet I've seen, you still have to manually input it in almost all fighting games she's in. But I'm happy everyone agrees, because there's been multiple fighting games that they're like, Bazit's in there. And she has mechanics with Fragrack. I, I would like, if I were to make it though, I would make it so it is automatic. You know, do you have... You know, if, if they do a level three, if you have three meters, you will interrupt them. Do you have one meter? You will interrupt them. Would that be annoying? Absolutely. But would it be canon? Absolutely as well. So we'll have to see what the, uh, what the answer that is. Because I think the next episode is the last episode. Yeah, ten episodes, but there's, I do have the shorts now. The shorts are on the Blu-ray. So we'll, we'll be watching those for sure. Because um, this is the end of disc one. So then, disc 2 literally says just episode 10 on it, but probably the shorts as well, because they've got to put those somewhere. The things those hands protected. Okay, that was a very spoiler-free uh, ending thing. So, alright guys, we'll see you next time for that then, for some more... Bait, Prisma Ilya to Zvi. So we'll uh, we'll see you then. Ciao.